Editorial with Vice President and General Manager Mike Murray. Back in 1992, the National Association of Black Journalists held its annual convention in the Motor City. Next week, NABJ will be back in town. More than 3,000 journalists and newsmakers will experience and report on how much the D has changed in 26 years. It's time for Detroit to show off its comeback city revitalization. All of these journalists, some of whom have not been here since 92, will get to see Detroit. Right. And I can tell you right now that folks are going to be blown away. The five-day conference will kick off Tuesday evening with a town hall meeting open to the public. The convention is expected to generate $3 million in direct spending and will spread across downtown. Headliners such as Spike Lee, Tyler Perry, Zena Garrison, Detroit's very own Sean Robinson, Vicki Winans and Kem will draw international attention. Several events will be open to the community. The convention will also recruit talent. This is the largest career fair for journalists in the world. That's vitally important to showcasing and growing some of the best communication experts in America. We also encourage them to get out and see all that the city has to offer. Our airport, the restaurants, the parks, the International Riverfront, the museums and outdoor markets. How can we let the whole um, world see what's going on in Detroit? And I have to tell you, there's a lot of interest in it, a lot of interest. But most of all, the NABJ convention is another golden opportunity for Detroiters to roll out their welcome mat and be great ambassadors for our guests from practically every corner of the United States. It's go time, Detroit. I'm Mike Murray. We welcome your response to this editorial.